YouTube, what is going on everybody? Back with another video. Hopefully everybody's having an amazing time on Cold War. Let me know what your favorite weapon is so far. Um, I have yet to use this amazing blueprint and I'm going to here soon to make a video on it. But anyway, let's get into this video. Today we're gonna be showcasing you all the assault, all the assault rifles, excuse me, um, without any attachments and showing the recoil patterns for these assault rifles. Um, I'm gonna show you exactly what the recoil pattern looks like. I'm not gonna use the analog stick at all. I'm just gonna let it go. Hold the trigger and you guys are gonna see some go straight up, straight down. Some go straight up to the right, some straight up to the left and maybe to the left and back up to the right. So I wanna give you guys and show you uh, to how, how to learn how to control this recoil of the base weapon obviously once you get attachments um, and level each weapon up there's horizontal recoil control there's ver vertical recoil control but obviously if there's a weapon that you can tell that doesn't have any horizontal recoil control you don't really need that attachment you just need the vertical one so and as you put more attachments on uh things can change here and there but i'm going to show you the base version of all five of these so let's jump into the five so we got the xm4 the ak-47 krig 6 qbz 83 and we got the ff uh ff ar1 so i'll be showing all five of these weapons all the recoil patterns for these and after this I'll, i will probably be making a submachine gun video on this as well because i know a lot of these submachine guns are very good and i'm curious to see the recoil pattern on those so uh hopefully this uh helped you guys um let me know if it did uh let me know what your favorite weapon is in cold war at this time uh i'll be curious to try some things out give me your give me your class up and maybe i'll make a video on it but hopefully you guys enjoy this video i'm gonna i can't wait to use this bad boy right here so this looks amazing but anyway man hope you guys enjoy it smash that like hit the subscribe button down below and i'll catch you on the gameplay peace youtube what is going on everybody back with another video okay today i'm going to be showcasing all the recoil patterns uh for all the assault, ri assault rifles here in uh, black ops cold war uh therefore you'll be able to see okay what can i do to control this what's different um obviously if it's up and to the right you maybe got to control it a little bit down to the left right um, you guys know how it works but i just want to show you what all these recoil patterns look like before you get attachments obviously once you get attachments uh with this uh with these weapons uh hopefully they get better that's what it's for so let's take a look at this this is the ff ar1 this is the last assault rifle that you get uh when you lock for the assault rifle so uh let's sh a little showcase really quick of this uh let me know what you guys think about this weapon um, and then we'll go ahead and take a look at this recoil. And I'm not doing anything but holding the trigger down right here. I'll show you guys. Yeah. Okay, as you can see, I'm going to do the same thing. Very fast fire rate. See, right there. Very predictable recoil. As you guys can see, I know it's hard to tell. But it's literally straight up, straight down. I know it goes away. I probably should have picked a wall, better wall for this. But the recoil, as you guys could tell, was straight up, straight down. So not a bad weapon at all. So let's jump right into the next one. This one will be the XM4. All right, guys. Let's take a look at this XM4. Kind of like the Commando, the M4. Man, this is going to be a solid weapon. I feel like in Warzone, whatever you use it in, it's going to be very good. So let's take a look at this really quick one more time. Let me know what you guys think. It's a pretty cool inspection. But anyway, let's take a look at this recoil from scratch. And like I said, these are all base weapons with zero attachments. So uh, don't be like, wow, that's a lot of recoil. Obviously, they will get better as you unlock stuff uh, throughout the game. Okay, that one kind of goes up. And at the end, it kind of tailed to the right. Let's do that again. As you can see, it tailed to the right just the last second. So straight up, tail to the right right now. Yep, there it goes. Straight up, I know it's hard to tell, but you can tell it tails to the right, right at the end. So that is the XM4, the Commando, the M4, whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, man, not a bad recoil for the first two. Let's take a look at the AK-47. All right, everybody, this is the AK-47. Um, let's take a look at this. Guys, this blueprint's pretty nice. That's what you get for pre-ordering the, the, uh, the Ultimate Edition. Uh, the digital edition. I'm not sure if, if it's for every pre-order. Let me know if I'm wrong, but I am going to make a video on this. I'll show it one more time. This thing looks really nice. Like I said, all the all these uh, that I'm showing have no attachment. So let's get into this one. This is the AK, which is a very, very good weapon. As you can see, it goes up to the left and then it tails back to the right. We'll do it, we'll do it again. To the left. Back to the right. Up to the left. Back to curves back to the right. Back to the right. 
That's the last second. As you guys can see it right here, better showing right here. So up, around, it's like kind of like a half circle, boom. Start here, back here. So that's the that's the AK-47, we'll do one more time. To the left, back to the right. Yep, and that is the AK-47. Let's hop into the Krig-6. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the Krig-6. Let's take a look and see what this looks like really quick. Not a bad inspection, kind of shows you the whole weapon. I think blueprints are going to be amazing in this game because the game was are pretty dry. I mean, the base, um, you, I mean, you don't expect that for a Cold War version game. But let's jump into this recoil. Uh, I don't like the, AD, the iron sights. It blocks a lot, man. All right, let's take a look at this. I'll back up just a little bit. As you can see, that one goes up to the left and tailors up to the right quite a bit towards the end. Yep, back up to the right. So start here. I'm not doing anything with the controller. I'm holding it down. Tails off to the right. So you can't really tell right here. Also, maybe I can scoot up a little bit. Up. Tail back to the right. Yep. So it starts down low. And it goes up. Tails back to the right. So basically the same thing as almost as the AK-47, that half circle. So that is the Krig-6 Assault Rifle. Let's jump into the QBZ. And this will be the final one for you guys. All right, YouTube, this is a QBZ-83 uh, here in Cold War. Let's take a look at this. Um, let's inspect it really quick. Pretty good inspection. That's a good one for a, a thumbnail or a screenshot if you need it. So I like that a lot. Let's take a look one more time. That's like perfect for an assault rifle. Not bad, not bad. Okay, let's take a look at this recoil. That one goes to the left a lot. Like I said, I'm not touching nothing on this analog stick. That one really goes to the left, up diagonal to the left the whole time. So obviously, to control these, you want to go the opposite direction. So, boom. See how I, you keep it down a little bit? You want to control it, obviously bring it back the opposite direction. So one time without, up and to the left. Up and to the left. I'm going to try to keep it right here in this white the whole time. See, so you, you want to bring it down and to the right, obviously, if it's up and to the left. So that is the QBZ-83, up and to the diagonal left. So guys, that is all the assault, assault rifles here uh, in Cold War. Obviously, we'll get more as the seasons go on and on. Uh, but yeah, let me know what your favorite assault rifle is so far. Let me know which ones you've been using. I've yet to use any of the assault rifles, to be honest. Um, I have used the MP5, travel, trying to level that up all the way, but I have not used an assault rifle. I'll probably go with the XM4, uh, just knock that one out of the way, or I might make the video on the Western Front AK-47, the new blueprint you get for pre-ordering. So, yeah, man, that's all I got for you guys today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, smash that like, hit the subscribe button down below, and I will catch you all later. Peace.